It's a final in Tempe as Utah gets on the board in conference play, getting a hard fought win 72 to 63 against Arizona State, ending the Sun Devils four game win streak along the way. Utah looked beautiful in the first half of play alongside Joan Bombasini. I'm Cindy Brunson. Utes with seven made triples in the first half, Joan. Well, and there's Gianna Neatkins as one of them, but they had players shooting everywhere. You would like. Who am I going to guard? Because everyone is knocking it down. Neepkins had 15 points in the first half to lead the Utes, who led by as many as 29. But at the half, Jade Lavelle and ASU woke up. Lavelle led the way for ASU with 20. It was nice to see her back after she missed Friday's game. Uh, the lefty has some sweet jumper, pull-up jumper. She is a player. You know, it's just unfortunate for ASU. They got so far behind. They needed to do this earlier, but I like the second half of action. So after holding Utah to just nine points in the third quarter, it was Neepkins clutch in the fourth quarter to seal the deal for Utah. This freshman does not play like a freshman. She is calm. She is cool. She is collected and she is a winner. The Utes only had two triples in the second half of play, one in the final couple of minutes, and that was hit by Neepkins as she led the way with 20 points, complemented beautifully by Brenna Maxwell with 15 points as well. As Utah gets off the schneid with its first win in conference play and will next face Oregon on Wednesday. Up next for ASU, the Bay Area Schools.